Hey guys, Sosa here with System 7, and today we are going to go over how to set up your company's hosted voice services at your home. We'll be talking through how to find and get started using System 7's web-based soft phone, how to download and set up System 7's smartphone app, and finally, how to use your office phone at your house. All right, now first, we're gonna get started with the web-based soft phone. So first thing we're gonna do is open up Chrome and go to mypbx.system7.net. And don't worry, there's going to be a link in the description below, so you can just copy and paste that into your browser. And to get optimal functionality, we do recommend Chrome as your browser. It should work on any other browser of your choice, but if you run into any problems during this how-to video and you're not using Chrome, please make sure to do that and then call support if it's still not working for you. All right, so after opening the login page, start by entering your login info. If you don't know your login or have never had one, contact your internal office manager who has that information. And then if they don't have access to it, uh, just contact our support team and we can get you access. So there's really no need to click on forgot password, login, new user. Uh, just make sure first step, always go to your office manager. Okay, so once we enter the portal, we're gonna click up at the top, it says web phone app and it will open up a pop-up window. It will probably ask you in the beginning if you want to allow access to your microphone, always press allow because that will be used as your web-based phone. Now you're gonna go over to the main menu section of the portal and that's at the bottom right section and you'll see here that it'll kind of give you instructions and show you how to use each functionality of this web-based app. So now that you're in the main section of the portal, you'll notice at the bottom right where you've got that little plus sign, you can see that you can start to make calls, your summary, you can start a chat. Uh, this is basically your office phone, but in a web-based version of it. This web-based portal will allow you to manage all aspects of your voice service, such as changing your voicemail, greeting, answering, forward settings, and more. Now let's get started setting up System 7's smartphone app. All right, so first we're gonna start off by going to the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store and download something called Snap Mobile. Through this app, you can use your cell phone or tablet for your business calls. This way you can make and receive work calls on the go or at home using your work phone number. So for the host ID, um, the host ID is going to be system7, all lowercase, no space, and the login name and password are the same credentials you use to log in to the MyPBX portal on the web app. Again, please get with your internal office manager if you do not have a login. Please make sure to grant access to notifications, contact lists, and microphones so you can make and receive calls. This should look very familiar to what you saw on the web-based portal, but now in mobile form. Lastly, if you're able to take your desk phone home with you, make sure to grab your AC adapter, your patch cable, and your desk phone. Once home, we're gonna plug the AC adapter into the back of the phone, then to the wall for power. Then plug one side of the patch cable into the internet port on the back of the phone and the other side into your modem for a network connection. Now, your VOIP phone is ready to go. As always, contact us if you have any questions or need any help with your work from home setup. Thanks so much guys for watching. Have a great day.